I'm excited to try Gemini in Gmail for the very first time. Today I opened my Gmail and I saw this pop-up about Gemini that is actually blocking out the rest of the interface, so I have to use it. So it says that Gemini is now here to help with our emails. It says that it can draft emails, catch up on long threads uh, and everything directly in Gmail. They promise that there will be more features and enhancements over time, which is great. Also, here is a really small note that interactions with Gemini stay private and protected. Here is a link. I believe if you click it, there will be the privacy policy. We have two options, learn more or continue. Let's click learn more first. It took me to this get started with Gemini for Google Workspace page. It says that starting January 15, the best of Google AI, which is Gemini, is now included in Google Workspace business and enterprise plans. We have some information about how Gemini works with different Google Workspace features. For example, we have Gmail in here, Google Docs, Drive, Sheets, Slides, Meet, Chat, even Vids, Gemini app, and Notebook LM. Here you have very detailed information about Gemini features in Google Workspace and depending on which plan you have, you will have different level of access to different features. Also here you can find some FAQs and related resources. Okay, let's get back to our Gmail. Now let's click continue. So we have this right side panel to communicate with Gemini. Here are three dots with more options clear history, more suggestions, and feedback. This panel can be resized, and obviously you can close it. And here is our field for the prompt. Let's try something very easy. Uh, for example, find all my unread emails. Okay, I have this information that to get help with that, I need to go to my Gmail settings and turn on these options, smart features and personalization, smart features and personalization in other Google products. Let's find them. I'm going to settings, see all settings. Okay, let's find it. Oh, I see smart features and personalization is already turned on, so I need to turn on this one. Let's click it. As usual, we need uh, to see more information from Google about what this is about. So with the help of this feature, we will get the most out of products such as assistant maps and travel. Mm -hmm. Let's personalize. Now I need to save. Great. Uh, to open Gemini again, I believe I need to click on this Ask Gemini button. Okay, I have this suggested prompt, so I would like to use it. Mm -hmm. So it used Gmail search to find all the important emails from my Gmail. Okay, um, find all unread emails. Mm -hmm. No emails match my request. Okay, that's right. Let's ask Gemini to compose something for us. So I will write this prompt. Compose an email to ask project update. Okay. It needs some time to compose it. Oh, it says type add to reference your workspace files. I'm curious to see if it can attach something. So now I have this very short email and I have different options. I can insert it, I can copy it, or I can retry with Google search. Also, I have an option to vote, like if it is a good suggestion or a bad one. Let's insert it. Mm -hmm. I have this inserted in this new message pop-up. Okay, it also gives me this hint that help me write uh, option is available in here. I believe you know this help me write option in Google Docs, so it is available in Gmail as well. 
Okay, let's click OK and click on Help Me Write. I have different options of how I can refine my message. I can polish it, formalize, elaborate, shorten, and also I can click Help Me Write and uh, give it a prompt. So let's simply formalize it. Mm -hmm. Or elaborate it. Okay, I can recreate it and now I can insert it. So now we have two variants side by side and I can choose one. I think I will choose the second one so I need to erase everything in here. I saw a hint that I can type add to find some files from my Google Workspace or maybe I can connect some other Google Workspace services. So let's try it. Uh-huh. I have some documents in here. I have my calendar. Let's try the calendar. I asked Gemini to create a meeting and compose an email with invitation. Sure, what's it called? Um, team meeting? Sure, when's the meeting? Today at 5 p.m. Uh-huh, so it created a meeting inside my calendar. I went to my calendar to check and indeed I have this team meeting today at 5 p.m. Let's ask it to compose. Uh, compose an email to invite to this meeting. Okay, so we have subject, we have some information. Okay, cool. Also, if I type add, I have some files that I can choose from my Google Drive and I can attach them to my emails. To sum it up, I think it is really convenient to have Gemini inside your Gmail. You don't have to go to a separate tab to use Gemini in there. As you can see, Gemini can integrate with the other Google Workspace services. It can find some files from your Google Drive to attach to your emails, which is absolutely great and really convenient. But always remember that Gemini for Google Workspace can make mistakes, so you have to double check it.